This is a Netgear modem, but this fix should work for any other brand modem or router. So the other day this modem lost power and obviously lost internet as well. So I plugged this modem to a different outlet, but the modem still had no power. But before throwing this modem in the garbage, I decided to check voltage output from the power adapter by using a basic multimeter that I got long time ago for about 10 or 20 bucks. If you have a similar multimeter, set the dial at 20 volts DC. If you don't have any numbers on it, just set it to volts DC and the symbol for it looks like this. Now place one of the leads inside it doesn't matter which one for this test, either red or black, and the other lead on the outer part of the jack. And I get a reading of 7.8 volts DC, and if I switch leads around, I'll get the same number with the minus sign in front of it. This basically means that this power adapter converts 120 volts AC from the wall into 7.8 volts DC, which is not bad, but let's see what this adapter is supposed to do. It's supposed to convert 120 volts into 12 volts. And since I'm getting only 7.8 volts, that means this adapter is no good. So I went to the local Goodwill store and found this used adapter for just about a dollar. And the output of this adapter is also 12 volts DC at 1.5 amps, which is also important to match to the original adapter. And here is the original adapter once again with output of 12 volts and 1.5 amps. And jacks on both adapters are exactly the same size, but under different angles, which doesn't matter for what I need. Let's plug the new adapter in, and the modem fires up right away. So there you go, $1 fix for this modem. And if you found this video helpful, please share it with your friends, subscribe, and also hit the like button. Thank you.